It's time for Airy Plays City Skylines 2. So this is the first time that I'm playing since the Economy 2.0 patch and the later patch that had a whole bunch of new service buildings. Um, I saw the service buildings in City Planner Plays video, which has really got me excited. It's what got me back into getting in. I'm just going to let these things happen here really quickly. Um, but, or maybe, maybe it doesn't matter. Maybe I'll load into Milford County. Um, I'm going to, I'm going to load the game. Um, so I'm not, I know I say this a lot, but I'm, this time is actually true. I have, uh, somewhere I want to be, so I don't have a lot of time to play. I'm not going to get everything done that I want to get done, but, um, I do know that there's a death wave and all these things and you may have to i may have to eliminate city services after the economy 2.0 patch uh, additionally um, there's a little hack that you need to do in order to get um the um, offices to have the right, a right amount of workers uh all right so here's where we left off we had 102 million dollars and we were making 863,000 per month if we were to go into the budget panel, it looks like this right now. Take a screenshot. Um, just realized that it wasn't, I didn't hear anything. Um, so let me double check. Uh, you guys, from what I can see, you guys can probably hear just fine, but, um, I cannot Let's see here. There we go. All right, now I can lower my volume. All right. So we're, I'm going to hit play. <laughs> and so we may see this. So we've, now we've got tile upkeep, um, which is not a surprise. Um, everyone, all the YouTubers talked about that. Um. But so far the money's still going up, so that's good. Um, my demand is all shrinking, but again, that's probably in line with what's going to trigger the death wave. I think they said you need to have like three in-game months. Right, so here's this gigantic freaking train station we've got here in... Is this the new place I just created last time? It's been a little bit since I was last here. Um... So let me reorient myself. Ah, right. This is my downtown area. So, um, realistically, this is kind of not, probably not the type of train station we would have. Although I do like that it has the bypass. So I probably will leave it alone. Um, that said, I, oh, another thing that I remember from City Planner Plays is that, um, some of the things like the um ah uh, shoot what was i gonna say the uh like the the number of employees it requires for something um so the cost will will shift once you put in a new building or whatever um so we've got this firehouse we've got this elementary school um and this elementary school is that's the playground uh oh yeah and that stuff doesn't need to be like right on right next to it anymore, which is nice. Um, but let me see, let me take a look at my, you know, I'm gonna fast forward. I meant to fast forward and I totally didn't. Um, let me take a look at my education situation here. All right, so we've got a, a high school there got another elementary school back there um oh yeah i'm using i believe i'm using a mod which is why i can see all this great information what have we got here? another elementary school here this one's like practically full now for the amount of space that we have here um all right let me oopsie daisy um in our downtown area this school kind of doesn't it in anymore so what if we were to replace it with the urban school first let me, let me turn this sideways let me make sure i actually 
have access to the um the urban school before I do anything. Um so if I were to go to nope, that's the wrong icon. Um or is it nope, that's the right one. Um so now we've got here the urban elementary school, and if I see it definitely takes up a lot less space, so we'd be able to reclaim some very important um space here um in our downtown area. So I'm going to go ahead and do that then. We will get rid of the elementary school. And we everyone's sad about that, but don't worry because we're bringing in the urban elementary school, which will also allow us to, um, and let's put the playground in. All right, cool, we're at Metropolis now. Um, but also, now we've got, look at all this extra space we have now. Um, so that'll probably take a little bit of time to fill up. But if I were to say districts, you are for here. Um, and we'll let you all be for Meadow Acres. Okay. So again, we'll let that uh, fill up if necessary. We'll come back in here. And I think perhaps what I will do here is, um, so we've, we've got these um, businesses, business slash uh, homes. And I think what would be nice would be, oh, what have we got over here? Oh, uh, we've got these new things, tunnel mode, retaining wall, awesome, okay. Although I think those <clears throat> may have come from a, a mod, I'm not entirely sure. Um, but we've also got a lot of new different types of parking lots. Let's see, a tiny one here. Tiny, really is tiny. Um, modest. Okay, and then small. And then medium. Okay, so they're, they're just longer, they're not deeper. So I'll put a small one there. Um, and then... Uh, I think, oh, we have zero demand for anything. Uh, oh, that might be the, maybe the X rate, I think. Um, I remember, uh, what's his name? Um, City Planner plays saying we need lower tax rates um, with, oops, with the game. Maybe, maybe we do something like this. Bring this down. <laughs> kind of go like that to kind of restore some of this. Yeah. Um, or she'll bring it maybe down to 10. Uh, that is not 10. Uh, industrial, bring it down. All right. And uh, we might need to wait for the death wave too. We're still in November. Um. So anyway, so now we've got this parking lot here, which um, should help a little bit here. And then I think what I'd like to do, uh, well, you know, I'm not gonna do anything at the moment because we don't have any demand. Oh, we're starting, maybe we were like maybe getting some office demand and like, yeah, oh, maybe, 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 maybe. Um, but I think maybe what we do is we will, we will do um, some row housing. Whoopsie daisy. Um, so, uh, one of the things, uh, I also watched um, City Planner Plays um, do his, um, uh, whatchamacallit, uh, Road Hierarchy video, and uh, I definitely do not have proper Road Hierarchy, which is why we're always having issues. Um, Alright, this building, we will... Demolish. Um. All right. And uh, so that explains why we're always having traffic issues. Um, that's something we're definitely going to have to um, take a look at going forward. Um, I, I may have to like, in uh, in the words of City Planner, plays call a mulligan or two. Um. All right, 
so. I, we, we did lose most of our, the rent is too high signs, which is nice. Um, let's see. Oh, and we've got some proper, um, elevated, uh, um, subway stations now, which is also very good. All right. What are we doing here? We're going over train tracks, right? Yeah. All right. Just re-familiarizing myself with my city. All right, we've got the university here. Uh, got our high school. Yeah, here's uh, all the old people are starting <laughs> are starting to die off. Oh no. Um, turn this about. Yep. Um, if we were to take a look. Let's see here, we've got a very large parking lot, medical clinic. A bunch of traffic there. Um, take another look at education here. So we have a community college there, got an elementary school here, which is pretty much 100% full. Um, all right, so we definitely have to fix that situation. Um, we may you know what? I think we'll put an urban urban elementary school right here. What is it overlapping with? There we go. That made everybody happy. Um, so this will be for... And that one's chock full as well. All right. So let's see. I'm going to make this one... Park Crossing... Where's Black and Blackwood? Okay. Beechwood, where's Beechwood? Oh, back there. Eh, that's probably not a lot of stuff. And then Emerson Gardens. Okay. So let's get rid of Emerson Gardens from here. Um, and then for this one, let's go Emerson Gardens downtown. And Pinewood. Um, let's see. What are you serving? You're ser also serving. Okay. So, let me. Where was I? Okay. So, this one is doing downtown. Okay. So if we were to come um, to here. We can get rid of downtown. Um. This just in from traffic. If you're thinking about okay. hitting the streets, you can expect delays on the major roads, especially during rush hour. We'll have to see where this goes. Oh, we're starting to get back our demand for low density. And if you can, plan your trip outside the rush. Oh, I don't know. I'd rather wait an hour in traffic than to have to start thinking about everything all the time. Besides, if I did that, I'd never get anywhere. Interesting news. From Vehicle the fire there. Division. Sources all right. tell us that our city has more services than we know what to do with. And you know what We're still in November for some reason. Why is this... Close well, no. The point is... Why is this going at a crawl? Is it just simulation speed? What's going on here? Almost say it's too much of a good thing. Or we could say that we're enjoying a positive trade balance. All right. And the economy is booming. More after this. Let's see here. Um, go back to education here. This one here is Birdsong and Autumn Mills. Okay. 
This one is Milford, Rosewood, Barlow Grove. Interesting. Huh? Um, got one back here. Doing a whole bunch of a bunch of different neighborhoods. Um, back here we've got one that's doing whatever, anywhere. So we need to make a district here, which apparently we didn't before. There we go. All right, so I'm gonna say you are only for Bedford Gardens. And same with you. Okay. All right, we're still making money. Um, uh, all the old people are dying everywhere. We've got a high school out here. This high school serves quite an area. But I may have done that in the past. So yeah, here's an area where I don't have proper road hierarchy. I don't have collectors and arterials and so on. And that's why the traffic is ridiculous. I also found out that um, the citizens will take the fastest route, not necessarily the shortest route. Um, that's interesting as well. All right. Um, given, oh boy, a tornado. That's not good. I think this is the first time I've had one actually, like, affect my citizens. Um, all right. So I think... Maybe what I'm going to have to do is, um... Is I'm going to have to come in when I have more time and kind of take a minute to not really do much development, but to, um try and fix my road hierarchy hierarchy also nice if this ran a little faster so i can deal with my death wave already but so it goes all right let's do a really quick drive through somewhere where there's not traffic uh, traffic jam i mean and um and then that'll be it for today let's see maybe over here where we made near where we made the new elementary school where was that? Oh. It was somewhere in here. What's happening here? Everyone is... trying to exit. <laughs> Everyone wants to be in this lane over here. Interesting. Alright, we'll... We'll grab this car here. This will just be a short, short one. So we kind of follow along here. Ah, interesting. He got, this happens to me sometimes in real life too. He wanted to make a left turn. So uh, even though it was green, he got stuck. Uh, but yeah, these are, these are all things I'm going to have to take a look at. Um, I think maybe worth, especially while we're waiting for the like death wave and stuff to sell out. Maybe we just want to work on our, our road uh, hierarchy if we can. I mean, this may be maybe a lost cause. I'm not sure. We'll have to see. I know it'll potentially involve some destruction, uh, some eminent domain, and so on. Um, this is very 
very pretty drive. Nice drive on this um, bridge that I have here. This bridge that kind of reminds me of the uh, Verrazano Bridge um, that uh, connects Staten Island to uh, Brooklyn. All right, well, then Eric uh, playing City Skylines 2 in this very short video as I kind of try to kickstart into the new economy, the new um, detail patch, and so on. And uh, hope, hope to get some more of this soon. Uh, for you guys, it may appear instantaneously. Um, by the time I finally get to this, let's play. All right, see ya.